Hello guys, in this tutorial we will show you how App Sheet Future works on mobile devices. Open the app on your device. Tap open App Sheet Future. Now tap in the profile. You will see all the sub sheets, terms and conditions, privacy policy and logout options. As you can see here, we have sub sheets like products, product categories, suppliers and transport, receiving and shipping. Tap open your desired sub sheet. You will see the labels of all the tables, entries present in the subsheet. As you can see here, we have different tables. Tap open your desired table entry. You will see all the details for the particular table here. You can see all the product details like product SQU, product name, base price, making price, total price, product category, etc. Tap edit to make your desired changes. Here you can change all the details as per your needs. Once done, tap update to save the changes. You will see all the changes has been updated. Tap trash can icon to delete the table entry. Tap back icon. From here you can search for your desired table. Tap the plus icon to add new table entry. Enter all the necessary information. Let's add a new product here. Enter the product SQU, product name, base price, making price, total price, product category, product image, signature, etc. Once you're all done, tap add. Scroll down, you will see a new table has been added. Tap on the entry to check the details. On long pressing the entry or sliding it to the left, you will see the edit and delete. You can directly edit or delete the entry from here. Tap open profile again. In the similar way, you can add, edit, manage the entries of your other subsheets. From here, you can check the terms and conditions of the app sheet future. Tap privacy policy to check the privacy policy of the app sheet future. The log out option allows you to log out from the app sheet future. This is how the app sheet future works on your app mobile device. Thank you all for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon to get the latest updates as soon as they go live.